Morning, family. We out here early this morning. It's Christmas Eve. We outside. I just got back from the gym. And I meant to do this the other day, but I didn't. I'm showing y'all what I did to kind of keep my dogs out of the cold. So, yes, I had to move them. Not because the wind was too bad, but just because it was just that cold outside. I put it up for the wind. The, the, the real cold weather came a little bit earlier than expected. So, I actually had to get them in the house. I think it was Thursday morning at like 6. It was still like 5.30, 6 o'clock in the morning. It's like 18 degrees, 20 degrees outside. And with the wind, the real feel was like 6. So, I'm out here snow blowing, cold wind, trying to get all my dogs in the house because it came a little bit earlier than I thought it was going to come. So, that was my mistake. But they are all inside of the garage out of all the weather. So, I'm about to show y'all. How I did my tarps. No, it's not some professional job. It's what I threw up together myself with a little bit of time before the sun went down and in the cold weather. So I'm gonna show y'all this. So let me get this camera turned around. I'm gonna show y'all how I did this. Let me see. I put them up on this side right here. Like I said, it didn't come out the way I wanted it to, but it serves the it serves the purpose. I haven't took my scissors and went through and cut off all the ends to the zip ties, but we gotta put up. They already had a tarp for their roof, so that was just kind of met right there. And I haven't cleaned it out since I took them out of here, so we're going to get all that done today so we can get them back outside here in the next day or so. And that one, I guess the wind took that one down because the wind was going crazy the other day, so you see like all the tarps is all the way across the back. Hold on, buddy. Hold on, buddy. And the tarps is going all the way back across. Everybody got a tarp on the back. And then another one on the end got the one on the side over here, so no wind was coming through these chemicals. It was just, you know, whatever kind of came through the front side. And these two got tarp, but that was from the summertime. So that's why they got those, because I had those two kennel during the summertime. But yes, I had to move my dogs. Daddy, so, the okay, so go in the house. I told you it was cold out here, man. Go now. So we're going to do a, a real good clean today. We're going to get these water bowls cleaned out. We're going to sweep all the poop. We're going to clean both food bowls out. We're going to clean that out as well. We're going to put fresh new cedar chips and straw inside the doll houses. We're going to get all this done today since I don't have any Daddy, dogs in here today. Casey, okay, so just go house, dude. So we're going to get all this done today. So I'm going to wait till I warm up a little bit. Maybe, well, maybe 12, 1 o'clock. Well, I may, maybe before then because the games is coming on today. Football game. So I'm going to try to get all this done today. So that I, they can be ready to come back outside tomorrow or maybe later today when it's warm. So this is how I did it. Like I told you all, it ain't no professional job, but we got it in. We did what we had to do to make sure all dogs was warm. So I'll leave these up for the rest of the winter. And then I'll probably, and the reason why this looks like this is because it's on top of the door. So once you fold it in, it covers that. I did that because I used to have my kennel sit up in another part of my yard. And when the sun was coming down on the end of the day during the summertime, she sat right in front of that door. And it was, she wanted to sit there, but it was just the sun was just beaming right on top of her. So she would move. So to allow her to be able to sit in her spot, I had that put up on there. So I, I just kept it. I never moved it. So this is what we did. Like I said, it ain't it ain't the best looking thing in the world, but we got it done. I'm gonna have to go back and redo that corner right there. I don't know what happened. I guess the wind just got that bad and snapped it. But all the rest of them held up. So I'm gonna actually, what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hold off on posting this video. And once I get everything clean, I'll show that part. And then I'll also show when I bring the dogs back out here. And then we'll be, uh, I'll actually end that video off like that. So until the next scene, family, we out. Family, Merry Christmas. This video did not come out yesterday. Like I said, it was gonna come out, but we're gonna finish it out today. I just, well, actually, when I got back from the gym this morning, I cleaned out all the poop. I snatched out all the water bowls. I refilled them. I just got finished refilling them. You see all the bowls got food in them. So when I bring them back outside, they got everything they need already. Nothing needs to be done. I put fresh punch, I meant fresh uh, cedar chips in the dog houses. So all this stuff is worth So we finally about to move them back outside. It's getting warmer today, so we're gonna move them back out. 
So everything is clean. Tarps is still intact. Water is full again. Food is there. So we about to start transferring dogs back outside again. We're gonna pick back up once I get them out here. And I'm gonna start talking to y'all a little bit more once I get them back outside. And I did snatch out this barrel for the dog house. I snatched that out. Cause they weren't using this one. They was only using that one. So I didn't feel the need to leave that one in there. I'm just taking my space, getting more room to run around since they only sleeping in that dog house. So I got that one. The only thing I do now is clean out the cedar chips out of this one. The old cedar chips out of this one, put it back in the shop. We finally got everything right. So now we're about to move the dogs back outside because it is because it is warming up again today. Finally. So now we're about to have them back outside again like usual like usual. I'll come back to you when I get them all back in that kennel. Family, the dogs are now back outside. The pups, the mom to those pups, dad to those pups, and beauty. The next, when she coming to heat, the next mama to be. So, if y'all don't know the names by now, you got beauty, G2, that's Boots, the mama over there, so I can see. Right there, that's Boots. And you got Medusa, Boogie, Mystique. And then Marilyn Monroe is in the house. She uh she kind of goes back and forth between the garage and the house because she had a home little area in the garage too. So that's where all the rest of them was at during this cold weather was in the garage. But yeah, I kind of bring her back and forth in and out the house. And I know they glad to be back outside because they didn't have the same area that they had out here. Completely different space. Especially when it's seven of them. Finally warm enough for them to be back out here. Cause I mean, I think we was, I think what I said, what I, I think it was what, 20? It felt like six that first day. And two days after that, I think the highest it got was like 10 degrees. But now we supposed to be going up into the sixties here in the next couple of days. So they really gonna enjoy this work. No, I still gotta fix that tarp right there though. I didn't fix that. I gotta do that. Oh, new stock. I noticed I did that in another video. It didn't look good once I turned it. But the dogs are back outside, people. Back in their regular areas. I let them run around a little bit before I put them back in there. Just to stretch their legs. And now they all eating. Enjoying their food. You still see the ice block. That was from two days ago. That's the ice block, too. I still got like maybe two or three of them on the other side of the basketball court. They still froze from two or three days ago. Look at that boy there. Look at that boy. Bug. That boy solid. What you want, man? Yeah, this video ain't gonna be super long. It is Christmas. My kids. Oh yeah. My kids opened up their gifts this morning, so I took that break in between after I left the gym. Until now, so that's the only reason they, they went out here earlier this morning. Cause I, I went in and did that. So now that they done and we got stuff together, I had to hear them put them back outside. So now I'm about to go back in the house again and get ready for uh, football this afternoon. That's the only reason I didn't finish this video yesterday cause I started watching football and I never got back to this. So I finished up everything I need to do this morning. But family, my next video is gonna be a little different. I was actually searching some stuff online and seeing what, like, what was the most searched topics when it come to like breeding dogs and stuff like that. So I got something that I actually have a personal experience with myself that happened with this litter, not with any of them, but a sister to them, a sister out of this litter that actually went to uh, the Dallas, Texas area. I had something happen like that to her. So I think my next video, I'm gonna be talking about that and how I fixed it. Didn't take the dog to the vet. It was, I did it all by myself. I just Googled it, YouTube it a little bit, and then I figured it out. I mean, of course, everybody do everything differently, so I, mine might've been a little different from how I seen somebody else do it, how other people actually do it. But my next video, I think that's what I'm gonna talk about. So it ain't gonna be, the next video ain't gonna be, no dogs will be shown probably, but I will be talking about dogs. It's gonna be something, I think that if you are trying to breed dogs and you have a litter of puppies, it'll help you out, because you could possibly lose a puppy like that if you don't know what you're doing and figure it out fast enough. But I'm about to get back in the house, family. I got more cleaning up I got to do with all the boxes and, and paper and everything else. So I'm gonna get out of here. 
this video this is christmas day so this video will be up later on today so when i post this video make sure y'all like comment subscribe you know all that good stuff until next video we out family